The following feature is rated SM for spiritual maturity and is not intended for the immature who wishes to remain as such. The views expressed are not necessarily those of our sponsors as they sometimes could care less about what the host is saying but is more concerned about having their product on a popular show. Warning! Small minds, listen at your own risk as this content is extremely overwhelming and may do further damage to those minds closed off to objective reality. Approach with an open mind as the heavy nature of the content will lick your chip. Your chip. In the meantime, 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 in between time, time in the meantime, in the meantime, in between time, time. All right, Purple Nation, you know what time it is. You know it's Curly Last Device Boxer check in for one more bonus episode of In the Meantime. Yeah, that one I entitled. Royal Pains Part 1 So as we all know by now, Queen Elizabeth II drop out You know, and shortly following the announcement After that, our Prime Minister advertised a 12-day period of mourning For the Queen So there is much conflict and divide over the issue, you know And um, some more going to some of the reaction, you know, in Jamaica to the Queen dead, the queen dead, the queen dead, the queen dead. Well, I feel so sad in a man And she's a nice lady And we like how she walk, we like how she talk and I, I miss her, and I feel it. So life goes on. It just said, all we have to do is just bury her, and just give God thanks and praise. Blessed love. Um, she have, she have do her time, and the Lord take her home now. So I, I hope she repent and serve the Lord before she go. You understand? I her time now, so she live even past the time. <laughs> so that's how things goes. We all have to go one day. Well, her death, to me, if she could have been the next year, she could have been but she just gone, just say go. But, God go with her. I mean, I don't have any reaction to her death, so. uh, I didn't expect her to die so suddenly. But, you know, considering the fact that she would have been with us for quite a long while, but, um, I mean, I just hope all goes well for the country. Well, you know, it has shaken us up because knowing that she, she was around for such a long time and she's one of the longest serving, um, whatever. And, you know, to lose her like this now, it leaves back her impact and we know we're not going to replace her, we cannot replace her for the long service that she has done. So, we feel it. Yeah, it has shaken us up. Well, I'll say I'm not surprised. Uh, it's been a long time coming. Not to say that she won't be missed or her service won't be appreciated, but she was 96, so it was expected. expected, expected, expected. And of course, there is um, opposite reactions to what I just hear, you know, but um, those reactions reflect the opinions of the, of the majority of people. So let me know in the comment section, you know, um, which view the item share. And if you normally listen but don't comment much, just type in yes if you think um, we should have moaned our passing or no if you don't think so. So make can know what you think. And if you don't just want to type in the regular Zion for show support for the channel and help push the algorithm, you know, we can get the program in front of more people. Because as you don't know already, this is the, the gossip where, you know, we stay trending in IL. We don't take nothing to promote. So it's going to take more effort to push this. So just Zion, you know, hard, no hard. In no, the no. meantime. In the meantime and between time, what is coming is coming. Give thanks to everyone who take the time out for acknowledge my birth date, you know, on September 13. You know, so a special shout out to Virgo Nation, you know, right now. My apologies to everyone where, you know, where me, where me couldn't get for reply to, you know. Because, you know, as you know, the amount of message we made to receive to numerous for got you. I respect to those who buy some extra copy, you know, a planet Earth and the road to Zion, you know, as, 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 as gifts to others, you know, as a birth date gift to me. Respect for that. For In the meantime. So while you now consider or contemplate and a type in an answer to the question I just asked about the Queen, more take the opportunity and now say, this section of In the Meantime is brought to you by Bunks About Kids Party Rentals. It's at Bunks About. When you want to customize that special experience to your child or just regular patrons in general that they will never forget. Link up, bounce about. And if you're there at Stone Mountain, Atlanta, Georgia, on a Friday night, and you miss the original yard style type of cooking, Dumpling House have you covered. And my book, Planet Hurt, is also available at Dumpling House. So double treat. 
And the contacts for both Dumpling House and Bunks About in the description. And in the meantime, it's also brought to you by Renaissance Immigration Services. The greatest thing for immigration in Canada. Hands down. Just call Renaissance now at 437-703-1147 to 8. And the consultation is absolutely free. And if you live on the American side of immigration issues and you have certain concerns related to immigration, you don't have to worry about Canada you live because America have the greatest thing when you have Lewis Law Professional Association. For them, immigration service is second to none in America, hands down. Them deal with all things related to immigration from citizenship, visa, removal of conditions, waivers, and all matters related to immigration in the U.S. You can rest assured say immigration problem solved. Call them now. 954-530-1717. In the meantime. In, in the meantime and between time, what is coming is coming. And that's a quick disclaimer when I hear Mr. British throughout this this thing, you know. This not necessarily reflect my outlook upon the entire British population. Who me sure said there is people who not agree with the many atrocities where the Queen commit. So again, I'm going to say the clips so I just play reflect the majority of the sentiments. You know, of the average Jamaican. So, I'm going to ask someone at this point, you know, if you don't hear the Stockholm Syndrome in our situation yet. For those who don't know what Stockholm Syndrome means, please, I'm going to look it up. I'm going to ask you know, the average Jamaican approve every day. Say a good majority of them don't even know where they're coming from. I only a Sebak, where other people are saying without thinking for themselves. I really listen where them really are say. <laughs> One of the women say she never expect her to be dead so suddenly. She 96. 96 year old. <laughs> oh, you don't know, expect it. And she plan her own funeral. The queen plan her own funeral. As she pick out the casket you know, and go drive around in the hearse and drive past all of the places where you see them and drive past now. You know. She rehearse for that day. You know. <laughs> so it's unexpected. Seriously. Jesus Christ! And 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 you know, for them head them realistic, you know. Them understand reality, you know. And them a think for themselves, you know. Further down, we're gonna read a VIP comment and um a letter concerning the same issue at hand. But um me go to my views, you know, upon the Prime Minister's reaction to the death. Which is expected, you know, but just goes to show how much the human animal live. In contradiction to everything where them say or believe, say them believe. In my view, the Prime Minister insult the memory of every single enslaved African where the British carry come here against them will. When him I got declare a 12 day mourning period. If you a tyrant, we benefit from that wickedness there and, and repent and bout it till the day she dead. You know what I mean? Me believe that people can change. But if them don't read before them dead, then them coward they can't get my respect. If my mother did dead and never acknowledge all of the fuckery what she do to me and my brother before she dead, then you'd hear me freely say the same thing. No respect. All right, Andrew. Might as well we start have a day of morning for every murderer we kill innocent people at Jamaica then. Because there's no difference when you celebrate the passing. For somebody will openly support the apartheid regime in South Africa. Even the very crown where she wear proudly is symbolic of the tyranny of the British monarch. Because like all of them must hear by now, the crown having two priceless diamonds with them teeth. One from India in 1805. And one with them teeth from South Africa with value 400 million US. And there have never been with a past or present, any kind of conversation, but carry them back. We just see them as owned by the British monarch. When in a reality, they are stolen goods. And I tell Mr. She, can, she, she might can't forget. Send them, send them, send them a thief in goods, you know, because it, them, do, them diamond, they literally they on a red. Regular. So don't tell Mr. She don't remember that. You have to ask me if it's more now, if it's somebody we invade and colonize India then. For 89 years after the Battle of Palassi in, a, in, 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 in a 1757. And in a 1947 when India gained independence and the British them left India. You know what the British them do? For the last final act of unrepentant wickedness, them bomb all of the Swiss the, 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 the system them in, in a India. 
and cause a bag of shit for take place. Pun intended. Because after them left the country, never have the financial resources to fix back the sewage situation right away. So India did have to start charge them own people by the minute. Figure shit. So you know, say them time they have a rich fee of diarrhea. If this are not a living example of how we believe system program, if we love what we think we eat and eat what we think we love, me no know how. Can the same prime minister we come out every week a ball about crime rate? Can really come now and tell we have a show respect for one of the biggest tyrant in the history of the country and perhaps in the, in the history of the entire world? This is like asking a woman we get rape. For show the last respect for the rapist we rape her, we suddenly drop out. Me know, say, no matter how, how much we point out this, you know, whether me or Wooly for other people point out these same examples, then the people in my government country I go, always find it difficult to acknowledge it. Because still news alert, like me say in a various episode in the meantime, these are the people, the upper class are the people who inherit the same values of the slave master. Because they are descendants of the house slaves who never see themselves as African. But through the same lens of the European slave master. I'm telling you, say slavery never end, it just evolve. And the business system, old MacDonald, aka the slave master, just find a different way if it do the same things. So the house slave we, we, we inherit the master's values, also inherit the running of the country. So not no change. So steel news again when they tell about independence. The whole of that are just one big theater. Politics. Remember the first time, whole heap of years ago, when my dear for tell Jamaica said they're not independent. In the way where them think. And I be a cousin. I know that a normal train of thought and whole heap of people agree. But sadly, them still no know what it truly mean. The upper class who lead this country never them never change them European values. So with them allegiance or commitment I got really there to the same slave master. And for them way of thinking and operating. Them always see the slave master as like a parent. But if you do everything for them, them never yet have the type of understanding. Them, de- them never develop the kind of maturity to understand so them have to do things for themselves. They never develop the spiritual, financial, or political maturity. Where tech have the kind of confidence for branch out on your own. So in 1962, regardless of what we think about own flag, national pledge, and prime minister, all of that are theatre. Because all of this time, the queen and the monarch are still head of state. I have the last say when it comes to any kind of decision what we make. So again, the question I may ask for, ask for decades is, where is the independence? The declaration of this 12-day period of mourning is a living example. And when we show you, you know, say all, you know, all the belief system program of love what we think we eat and eat what we think we love. So now tell them again, I forgive them, because they don't understand their mind. And the puppet and pawn where them is to the demonic game where them are play. It's big on them, so I don't have a choice but to forgive them. So me not even disappointed. Because by now me expect nothing less a politician. From both sides of the fence. Who live for deceive. And deceive for your living. So to Jamaican politician from both sides. Me I go ask. And I bet you no think on no fear and honest. In everything I want to do now. And all I want to believe. But ask on yourself. On the declare a day of mourning for Bob Marley. Peter Tash, Bonnie Wheeler, Tabby Diamond, Bob Andy, and the many greats who actually give something positive to, 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 to Jamaica. We need to have a day of mourning for these people who do more for the country than the Rasta killer when he bust a And none of them no bury a hero circle. And what if people are going to say, fuck me attacking? You know? But like our fuck me attack, I hope after this, them plan for a 13 day. Period of mourning for Barry Saman, Sanchez, Papa San, Shabarangs, Luciana, Bunty Killer, Beanie Man, and all of the great people when for them time come. Because them people are restore some semblance of dignity in the descendants of stolen Africans and give them at least a hope so them can be something great and find them way out of the darkness where slavery left them in. 
And by slavery, I mean the torture and the hell where the British monarch give them. I be a wickedness on the love and celebrate. Seriously, Mr. Wallace. By the clearing, a 12 day period of mourning where people can keep nothing at all or have no kind of function the right when they have nothing to do with the Queen. I don't think it's right to take back people permit because they can't keep nothing when they have nothing to do with a Queen who for grand picnic come here with him wife. And Babs, they try to touch the wife for shake her hand. And she snub her, basically flash her off. Me don't know if I too much hug up and too much shaking hand and one bag of thing and plastic smile for you. Me don't know. Or if Bob's the too black. But my man are comfortable in that video you know, there. But at them people there with certain values. Who no look up to and, and praise and accept them same values there. Like them, like it normal. So you get to them, my I hope that make you see certain things on a different perspective. Because earlier the same day you embarrassed L.A. Lewis for nothing. So I don't know. Karma, I don't know. It's embarrassing to see the leaders of the country still appraise this institution or, or a monarch who at one point them number one rule of royalty was never touch common people without our gloves and never make them touch you without permission. And you want me to mourn for people who have them kind of values there. But I know the queen that. But I know the queen herself that. You might say. How about a queen when in a 1962 the Ghanaian president touched her without permission for ask for a dance and them declare it a social crisis in England? Because the crown see it as an act of hostility and it seriously I consider for mobilize the, the army for attack Ghana. Seriously, Mr. Holness? Really? You know, see the cognitive dissonance. We are fuck up with country. Up with country. Up with country. Up with country. In the meantime. Look what them do with Roots Rock Reggae. Original Reggae. Because it, it, it was and is the vice of the, of the modern oppressed, the descendants of, of, of the oppressed. Them replace it with the Disney branch of Reggae, which is nothing but a costume party. Them fight against it and call it Dirty Rasta music in the 80s when Bob Marley and Peter Tosh and Bonnie Wheeler them had beat. And when the world take on to it, them use them Constantine strategy, the same strategy where Constantine used. They say, okay, I'm a follower of Christ and everybody does believe. And it changed Christ's movement. Still news alert, by the way. The same way them pretend to endorse reggae. I met them pick me who have the same corrupt values as them. Take it over. And I be a prep school rasta who, 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 who not live these kind of values. Who are politician and pretenders like them parents. Take it over. But the song I remember plays from an artist named Incline, who is like a big brother to me, who helped me through some serious struggles. You know, helped me, slash we, through some serious struggles. You know, who me used to look up to when the whole of the achieves I'm a fight for the break. Him say, I'm still a reggae them in an authentic way, despite protests against authentic reggae. Incline, reggae them. Here goes. Here goes. That thing don't change. Reggae music is the weapon on the firing range. We still a reggae game with the roots, reggae rock. And the message in the music means we just not stop. Back in the olden days, when the reggae was born, when the first man make the first big sound turn on, there was a mic, a crowd, and a big bamboo lawn. And the rest, they say it is history. Holy Rover don't get so big, it had no mystery. Bread from the grassroots and History. African DNA and man chemistry One of the greatest music in our history We still are wrecking Run it, run it, run it Look, look, that's how they hurt daddy, go ahead Bread from the grassroots and that's a history. A 
African DNA and man chemistry. One of the greatest music in our history. We still a reggae day, man, not that thing don't change. But your music is the weapon on the firing range. We still a reggae day with the roots where you rock. And the message in the music, may we just not stop. Still a reggae day, man, not that thing don't change. Bring your music is the weapon on the firing range. We still a reggae day with the roots where you rock. And the message in the music, may we just I mean, no, no, about no fruit loop artists. I tap computer key. I said technology. I will make them think them my artists. Back in the olden days when we started, I fling lyrics parody. in my we are clotted. Me said them never see it coming. Said a little ghetto youth would have turned international artist. Reggae make them leave them scene and don't leave them dream. Take care of them queen. Reggae put food in a food basket. Yeah. Still a reggae day, and not that thing don't change. Reggae music is the weapon and the firing range. But still a reggae day, with the roots reggae rock. Message in the music, me we just not stop. We still a reggae day, and not that thing don't change. Reggae music is the weapon and the All right, Calvin Incline, yeah man, know me boss production. Link Calvin pan IG at Calvin underscore Incline pan Facebook at Calvin. In, you know, link him pan him YouTube channel which is Calvin Incline same way. This is roots rock reggae, like how burning spear them keep it real and simple. Yeah man, the one yeah. Available on all reputable online platforms. So go out now, go support this. Reggae day, reggae day, reggae day, reggae day, reggae day, reggae day, reggae day. Gangsta's purple. I tell you, family, I said that. When we say purple, we mean that. 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 And at this time, I got to remind you, don't forget my book, Planet Hurt, on Amazon. And you can get um, the revised version of my first book, The Road to Zion, also on Amazon. And you don't know, Planet Hurt is available locally at J.A. Deals, Constance Spring Road, right across from the bus center in I Plaza where Mother's Day. And you don't know, you go to jadeals.com and check out the rest of them locations. And the book is also available locally, you know, at selected locations of Kingston Bookshop. And volume two of Planet Hurt, I got released real soon. And also the course, you know, the courage to be relevant. I go out soon too, so only just stay tuned. And also be reminded, and for those who don't know, be aware. So the season three finale, you know, of Rootsland. You know, it's all up on iTunes and Spotify or wherever you get your podcast. Remember, join the channel membership or become a patron. You know, the links are below. We have help the item. Do that. So turn up on the support for the channel. Because trust me, we don't have a clue where it takes to keep this thing going. Going. In the meantime. Alright, purple people, let me ask you something. Which part of a vital lesson we in the meantime teach on a see a go on yaso with that declaration yeah, of this 12 day period of morning? Let me tell you. Know, we no see the one where somebody have to do the same wickedness where them condemning the other people. So them rename or rebrand it when them have to do the same thing for whatever reason. You know, see it? I'm going to one of the examples again. Like me always say, the next person greedy for I'm six dumplings, but you hungry when you're I'm ten. So we have a government on both sides <coughs> where see cartel as a murderer and see the queen, Henry Morgan, Christopher Columbus and Bustamante as decent and proper human beings. Who do we them did have to do? Including murder, rape, pillage. If you do again, wait. See the word, yeah? Civilize the world. Mr. Wallace, let me show you now. The only legacy Britain or the monarch left at Jamaica is the trauma of slavery and the ill-fated education system where structure or built pan a white supremacy will serve them to this day. Purple Nation, you see now why we don't have a Bob Marley, Miss Lou or Marcus Gavide. Alright, so as promised, me I'm going to read the VIP comment and then the letter of the day, you know, it'll come from, well, the VIP comment will come from Andrew 606, it's a vice box. I'm disgusted by the majority of the reactions that I am seeing in regards to the Queen's death. Most of these people know better, but are just wicked. I don't see how they can love a Queen who was so wicked unless they themselves are irredeemably wicked. That's my take. What's yours? 
that fearless shot, that come in the fearless shot. So I'm gonna read the letter first and let me answer them both. All right. So the letter coming to in the meantime, read a show at gmail.com is coming from Kevin Richardson. Kevin, I say, Eel Vice Box, greetings to you. I wanted to get your view on this whole Queen's debt that everybody is making a big fuss about. I think people are ignorant who hate the Queen for something her ancestors did. Slavery was abolished long before the before Queen Elizabeth. Yes, yes, Queen Elizabeth II, yeah. Te- took the throne. Okay, cool. Kind of slightly but typo. What we need is to stop making excuses, unite, and move forward as a people. Well, Kevin, um, not everything is really an excuse. Something's a legitimate concern. Remember, balance me say over here, saying over purple. You know? But watch out, Kevin. Hold on. Me go read. Me go answer them. Yeah, me go answer Andrew coming first, and then me answer um, your concern and your letter. So. Anjo, me understand where you say, as me express similar sentiments, as you can see, you know, earlier, me express similar sentiments, but bear in mind, say, it's still not that simple, as you put it, it's it not that simple. And I always say some people know better, and just wicked, and, and, and I don't want to say nothing wrong with where a person do. Because sometimes, or most of the time, it's a perspective problem we are experience. Meaning, say, perspective meaning, say, which part we day when we are looking upon a certain thing. Like in our case, I know where, where, where you are, say, boy, you know, you can't understand how people can love this queen who do so much wickedness. But, but you know, while me understand that, you have to remember, say, your outlook on it depends on which side of the fence you depend. on. And you have to consider whether you is a direct receiver of, of the person, cruelty or them kindness. Everything was shape what you think about a person or thing only come from where you get to see or experience. Remember that. It not come from the whole reality or everything about the person. Worse if you don't know them from birth. Every man terrorist is another man freedom fighter. You ever hear that? Like me tell you no, in I wrote to Zion. The same way how me never, you know, see my uncle Barrington as a murderer for show up see. Because him never show me or we then the murder side. I'm character. Them not show them family that side there them. The only part of that side them family with black road for them and go on bad. So everything we me did get for see was the only tools we did have for use and put together the idea we did have for my uncle. Well, I see him, so the queen is a goddess. For those who get for see, our experience the humble part of our nature. Because again, good and evil in everybody. Because again, Hitler, a man who killed so much million Jews in a gas chamber, did often ball like water for Snow White and the seven dwarf. To how, that, how touching that story was to him. I'm sure him family and those who are close to him. See a side of him with the Jews and him, and him victims, them not see. So yes, the queen is a goddess to those who see that side. So them cannot see where the victim of our cruelty is. And perhaps we'll never see it. For example, why do you think you can't have two sisters with a war from them born? And the wicked one, out of two of them, get a man at the age 40. And, and the good sister can't tell the man nothing about him, woman, which is for her sister where she know from birth. She can't tell the man that nothing about her sister cruelty. And because he's not experienced that side there of, of him, woman. So in frame of reference, only I come from where him see our experience. So be mindful, say, so in another situation, yeah, with the queen. There's people who lose their mother and a grandmother, even though the monarchy where she represents is responsible for the killing of millions of mothers and grandmothers. Despite all of that, is a sweet old lady, them know. Why do you think most slaves were born in a freedom? They'd have a way different outlook. And slavery from the one them were born in a slavery. The one them were born in, I couldn't see it because them never, them never know freedom, so them can't compare it to slavery. In other words, if them search them life, them now go find freedom missing because them never free yet. And now, if you answer Stephen on the letter, yeah, man, stating at all times, so we need for unite is no different from when Nancy Reagan or anybody else, I said, boy, um, you know, say no to drugs, it, you know, like it really that simple. Addiction, yeah, that we are deal with. I'm gonna say it all the time. Still news alert. Addiction and an ABC. Unity can only come from the true understanding of the objective principles and discipline. Where we have to understand if people are gonna work together in a, any kind of relationship on any level. If them discipline there, we we higher than all away, not elevated or put above the ego idea of self, then unity will forever be a wish. Because everything where we serve are gonna selfish. Identify and fix the individual and you fix the group. Because if the individual learns to bow to the objective, unchangeable truth, we higher than them, whether it be true, if they never born, then they can work with any group. 
You have to say she can't be responsible for, and for, for where her ancestors them do. But she endorses it to the fullest. Because on various occasions, whenever people confront her with the topic of slavery itself, she said nothing wrong with it. Because slavery is legal at the time. So she don't recognize the Caribbean or any other kind of people who pose that question there. I try say or, or a chat about. You have to remember, you know, Kevin, or perhaps then, me should I say, no say. In a fair time when she did the on the and the British occupy and colonize Kenya. A set of Kenyan named the Mama Warriors, they, where they would rise against British occupation. Face it from the crown, man. The British deal with them in the most cruel, inhumane way. You can't imagine. Even Barack Obama grandfather named Hussein Onyango Obama, who did a part of the Mama Warriors. The British holy man should make them squeeze in balls with that, with that thing when they castration pliers till the bus. And order the guard them to beat him every morning where God sent. And if you don't, me check the reputable source when you name the guardian and you will see it. Moon for she? You must be fucking mad. The problem in our situation, eh? like in our most situation, no matter what we say and what we learn and which information we get, we're not going to change. Until we understand say, the problems that we are experiencing psychological. The solution for that problem yeah, is that we need a, de- a decolonization. Means that we need to undo the colonial way we interpret reality as Jamaicans. For the problem actually fix, we need a cultural, psychological, systemic and structural decolonization. Because what? See, we are in a 2022. Very conscious of our every problem is. And can point them out. But we're not then nowhere close to solve them. Because we now get rid of the structure or the system where create the beliefs we bring her right back to the problem. No matter how much we intend to solve them. In other words, if we make those who don't understand what we just say, a full time, you say a full time, we get rid of the European value system where inform the opinions, you know, our government and influence the laws we govern we affairs in other countries. Get rid of the European or British curriculum in our school. Get rid of the curriculum in our school system. No. You notice, say them don't notice. Say almost no picnic no know or even care about the little Jamaican history where them teach. But the school system can make sure. Them find time to make sure. So the student them pants not too tight or them skirt not too short. Which brings me to the ridiculousness, the absolute ridiculousness of the situation, you know, where I go on with the student, them, I get sent home. Me and us, I understand. So rules are rules. But this educational system, these, these people who are holding on to this old, archaic, outdated British rules, British etiquette, where they put over the very education of the youths themselves. And the system, they overdo it. Ask Wooly for them teacher ya. But Marcus Gavi and them can't tell you fuck. But man, them tell you how Columbus discovered Jamaica with a broad smile upon them face. And them can go on for days with a liar story there. Not not do them pants and skirt they want me see unless me blind. And look how no serious about that. But they don't really serious about these 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 pitney. Learn. Not not all about them own identity. But have holy for say. When these youth become destructive to society, because they must search for it. No Jamaican pitney should have should have been better able to recognize the queen. And and and, and no feed them liar story. And don't know nothing about Marcus Gabby and Paul Bogle. Or even Bob Marley. How the hero factory burned down after the first seven? Awa. Hero no fit the rest. No answer that. Me I go answer it for me in, again in a part two. All our no leaders have got stop ball about every problem of Jamaica have. Because them not going to change if up to today we still committed to a romanticized idea of this British royal family. And even over, over a period of years, most of we still can't separate the mythical idea of the British royal from the horrible process where it takes to keep the idea going. We need not to just go away, but grow away from the colonial idea ourselves. That is the primary marker of our own identity as a Jamaican to this very day, 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 day. Oh. In the meantime, 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 in between time. Time, in the meantime, in the meantime, in between time. Time, time. 
time.